Hey guys, so I'm usually on the fence with certain programs that they try to sell you and pitch you and saying, hey, if you do this, you'll definitely get a job. But I came across this one that's very, very interesting and it didn't say that you could end up getting a job, but it was kind of like staring again uh, towards that direction. Like, hey, if you're looking into getting into cybersecurity, uh, certifications alone is not going to do it for you. So you need real hand on, hands-on experience. And if you don't have a job that have experience you're not gonna ever land a real job so the point was in that th their selling this program is to simulate a SOC environment using real life tools so let me show you guys exactly which one I was watching first on Instagram and then I'll show you their website so this is what I came across and right now this was a advertisement you can see is sponsored and I'll play it starting from here because I kind of double record it. So, oh, let me fix the audio on that so you guys can hear it a lot better. There we go. Let's... I think you should understand. Imagine if I take a course for 1999 from Udemy, how to become a Navy SEAL, watch all the videos, pass the exam, got the Soldier Plus certification. Now, am I same with the Navy SEAL? Not. What makes a difference is the hands-on experience and the field experience. That is why many people, they're holding multiple cybersecurity certifications, but they're having no luck to prove themselves in the interviews that they can do the job. That's why we started Sideo Security Operations Center. So this is not a simulated work environment. It is a work environment itself. All the enterprise level tools like Splunk, CrowdStrike, Jira, IBM Curator, all the tools that you're going to use in the SOC Center is here. And you will have a real SOC shift and you'll have a real attack from all over the world. So you will actually work in a SOC center. You will learn the tools and the fundamentals at the same time. It's four weeks, very intense training. After four weeks of the training, you will have real hands-on experience as a SOC analyst. When you go to SOC interviews, when everybody is showing their certification, you're going to show them your technical competency and your experience. You will be able to say, when I have an incident, this is how I respond to the incidents. This is how I hand over my shift to the next person. So all the experience, details, meetings, procedures that what's going on in the SOC Center, you will learn all of them. And we're running very interesting promotion for this program. The program is four weeks, which is 28 days and 30 days money back guarantee. This is how much I trust this program. Join the intro session. Find out if this program is for you from your instructors. See you there. Take care. Uh the limp sicking, <laughs> I don't even know if it's AI or not, but uh, he, he did say something really interesting at, at this one particular point was that it's not a simulated environment, it's a real work environment. So I'm pretty sure it's this company's, you know, staged area for this particular program. So it's a real life, you know, uh, scenario uh, that they're dealing with, right? Uh, whether it's this training arena platform or... Uh, which we, I, I guess you can call it a room, okay? Uh, like, you know, like a like a hacking room or whatever it is, or a honeypot room, anything like that. So I, I came back onto the website. Uh, four weeks became five weeks because now they actually threw in this AI part of it, right? Security Operations Center training plus Python with generative AI for SOC. So it increased a little bit uh, as far as time, and now it's five weeks. It's a live session. 81 hours. The other thing is, uh, you know, he says there's money, 101% money back guarantee. I don't know what that means, but 100% are they paying me if I cancel an extra 1% on top of what I paid, which is the $12.99, guys, uh, program t tuition. Now, the, the part that I'm on the fence with this is that I don't, I'm not sure about the training, right? Uh, the training itself, it really depends on the, the teacher, whatever, the course outline and all that, which is all laid out here, which is great. But the thing is, I mean, I haven't personally done this, so I'm not sure. The reason why I'm on the fence is because this is not going to guarantee you a job either, right? You're, you're thinking, hey, I got certification. I got my security plus. I got whatever. Uh, you know, entry level certifications for cybersecurity. I may have my bachelor's degree in cybersecurity, but I really have no hands on. I haven't never ever touched Splunk. Uh, maybe you should have by at this point if, if you're trying to get into cybersecurity because it, there's, you know, different platforms where you can uh, play around with that. Uh, CrowdStrike, they're, they're talking about IBM Q Radar. I've, I've worked with Q Radar. It's not that great, but 
it works, okay? Uh, there are other things such as CrowdStrike they're talking about here. And, uh, you know, obviously CrowdStrike is a, a very dominant uh, in the space, in the, in the market right now for a lot of organizations. So if you know CrowdStrike and you work with CrowdStrike, I'm actually like, holy cow, in the last week I've, I've done like 12, almost 10 or 12 different um, modules in CrowdStrike uh, from administrator to their sim platform to every everything else because that's that's what I need to know in order to to sell it right. So uh, daily stock meeting things like that right. It, it's basically going over the day to day operational stuff. They're training you, teaching you. So the reason why I'm on the fence with this one is that it it gives me a lot of great vibe as far as yeah this is things that we would normally do on a day to day. This is not something you can learn on the certification on a Security Plus. Or just by reading it, you actually have to go through the entire program uh, or work in the environment to actually go through this stuff, right? Uh, SOC practices with SIM and Wireshark, that's, that's awesome stuff. But my, pro my problem is, you know, after earning this, uh, you, they're talking about a uh, comprehensive skill set. That's just great. You learn all these different tools, uh, current market items, tools uh, related to cybersecurity. And then career advancement, gain the confidence and security that comes with being a highly skilled professional. Now, if you're already in the field, you probably wouldn't need this because you have the tools that you're working with already, right? So that's where you're getting your real hands-on experience. Again, it doesn't mention here about like getting your next job. There's no guarantee on that. But what he did say is that, you know, when you get to possibly an interview for a stock position, you're at least more prepared. And then you know, you know, some of the processes and frameworks for, for becoming a, or the task that a SOC normally would do. And then here you get your certification of achievement, meaning you actually took the course. So my, my point is for $1,300, it's tough, right? Especially if someone's looking for a job. And the other thing is that if, if it was up to me, I would probably, there's, there's so many other ways to learn this stuff without having paid $1,300 that you can get more insight into how CrowdStrike work, how IBM uh, QRadar works, how uh, Wireshark works, so many other ways, uh, not necessarily certifications, but just paid programs, right? Udemy, things like that. Um, my thing is right now, if, if you're out of a job, the last thing you want to do is spend more money on something like this. So there are tons and tons of pre, uh, free or at least closer to cheaper uh, platforms that you could probably pick up things and learn it uh, opposed to spending so much money on a uh, set program like this one. Now, who's this for? Um, <laughs> I mean, if you really have the extra money to spend and you don't really don't, uh, you're not paying out of pocket for it, then then by all means, right? Someone gifted this to you and be like, hey, let's just, uh, in, in a hypothetical case, I was so nice to like, hey, I think this program works for you. You know, here here's a voucher that I paid for. Take it. Uh, hopefully, you know, you can land a job with it after the fact. But th that's no guarantee. And, and possibly 100%, I would never do that. <laughs> Because I don't know what benefits I would get out of that, but uh, and and if even if someone hired you uh, without any type of experience, just based off your certification, based off the fact that you did well in the interview, based off the fact that you were able to sell yourself, you were enthusiastic, you were able to you know adapt and wanting to learn more, they probably would not support or sponsor this as well because they feel like there's other platforms that would be able to. Uh, benefit by you know these other programs you know my last organization they were very high on Udemy uh, current organization they're very s vendor specific like meaning I'm either learning Microsoft directly from Microsoft Learning or I'm learning CrowdStrike directly from the CrowdStrike University so third parties not so much so that's where I wanted to share with you guys uh, the, another program I don't feel like it's necessary don't fall for it uh, even though they threw in this whole AI bit now, you can learn all that independently, freely on YouTube or any other cheaper platform than paying another program. All right. I want to thank you guys for being here and I'll see you guys again really soon. Take care.